Sammy and Fair. I come again. The famous husband and wife variety act are in town as we speak. They're playing at Nero's Palazzo, and it's sold out. Oversold, in fact. Yeah, cause half the ticket holders would be too drunk to show up anyway. God, I love this town. So, how did the hottest act in town end up at the Molinari's place? The Molinari's hired the couple to draw new customers to replace the ones you drove away from their casino. But if the show were cancelled... They'd all want a refund, and the Molinari's would take it right in the assets! And how would you suggest I go about breaking up their little show? Fry them on stage? Nothing quite so drastic, my hypo-violent No. I have a more entertaining idea. Yeah. I say we take two corn muffins, a live badger, a teaspoon of flesh-eating bacteria, and... Uh, and uh, I suppose you just want me to talk to him. <laughs> the word around town is that Fair has been making goo-goo eyes at a certain southern rock and roll personality by the name of Leg Tallman. Perhaps a touch of marital trouble. So, what do you say, Crypto? Ready for a little marriage counseling? All right, Pox. I'll go snatch the singing hick and bust up the lovebirds. Good! Let's make their breakup one for the record books! Yeah, just let me slip into something a little more comfortable. Southern comfortable. Find Fair's not-so-secret boyfriend, Leg Tolman. And Sammy and Fair's marriage and TV show finished. They say to always bet on black. What if it comes up red? What happens then? at the Sultan? Damn! I love that guy's music. People tell me I sound just like him, too. Train collector coming through! More brains! Blonde locks your own. Ah. Snatch him. <laughs> I got you, sweet Matilda. Nah, that'd make it crappy sometimes. Martians on the loose. <laughs> hey, I think I'm drunk. Yes, yes, physical sensations don't rub it in. Sleep it off later! Just get to the Sammy and Fair show! 
Looky, Hershey. You trying to start a fight, funny guy? Ah! Hurry, Crypto! You need to get late time to lose the before the show starts. I think I'm too late. It's about to start any si Free your mind of distractions, Crypto. That voice, it's... it's in my head. What voice?! Concentrate on expanding your mind. That voice! Are you really hearing voices, or are you angling for a Section 8 like that cross-dressing fellow on M.A.S.H.? You know, Klinger, who in the later episodes wasn't in drag anymore because Radar left? Meditate with me, Crypto. Meditate? If it means doing this, <laughs> hell yeah. Crypto, why are you wasting time? The show is moments away from starting! Hey man, I heard that hot babe fair is performing tonight. Yeah, she sure is, but Sammy warned me to keep you out, sir. No way, dude. Why you gotta be so down on a rambling man? Because the last time I let somebody suspicious in, the whole casino got wrecked. Man, you don't know who you're messing with. Uh, uh, me and the Molinari bros are old buddies. Please, you wouldn't know a Suprasata from a Gabagol. Listen, man, I'm just Cupid's errand boy here. I gotta see fair. It's about love. All right, fine, go in. But when you get thrown out head first, don't come crying to me. There! There they are! Send them into counseling! We've got each other, hun. Thank you! All right, Jehoshaphat. Uh, that's entertainment. Yeehaw! Ladies and gentlemen, the original Midnight Rider, Blake Tallman. Come on up, Blake. I'd like to give him a leg up. Woo! Ha <laughs> ha! Hey, Blake. We're always up for a little showbiz repartee, but what are you trying to do? Break up my act? <laughs> No, sir. It's just my boyish southern charm. I can't help it. Well, that's a relief. For a second, I thought you were trying to steal my girl. Listen, schnoz, I want to steal your girl. I won't have to try. Know what I mean? Well, that's just rude, man. Nah, I'm just a good old boy. Can't help it if you're a good old man. Well, that's just rude, man. Me and her? Say that again. Okay, then. Gypsies, tramps, and thieves couldn't keep me away. He was born a rambling man. Woo! Well, that'd be just my kind of luck. <laughs> I always did have a hard time with women. A hard time with women? <laughs> Not from what I hear. <laughs> Jeez, Leg, that's hitting kind of below the belt. What are you talking about? You got too many women. I'm gonna take one off your hands. Oh, Leg, take me away. You know, not a lot of guys who look like me could get a fabulous diva like Fair. I say, I mean, a goddess hanging out with a big nose twerp like you, she should get the best actress award. Woohoo! 
That's it, man. I'm going into politics. Because I'm a solo act. Relax, babe. The beat goes on. You know, if it weren't for us, I bet they would have gone on forever. Thank <laughs> you.